The executive governor of Cardona State, Mr. Na Saerofai, has spoken out on how he will handle things if another political party aside the ruling All Progressive Congress wins the 2023 governorship election in the state. The governor, while having a media chat on Channel TV, was asked what his next line of action will be should the ruling party be defeated in the next post. He said that if APC is defeated in a state, he will invite the elected governor and also the state chairman of the party that got the victory to sit to the seat in the state of execution executive council. He said that the reason for such decision is to have an easy and each free transition of power when his tenure elapses in May 2020. Is it 2023? Governor Erufai went on to say that the interest of the state will also prevail over any other interest and that this is how he view he views things. Hmm. Okay. Well, are you sure this guy is not just trying to be to be to be smart by half? <clears throat> well <laughs> Erufai. Now wow, that is how it should be. Okay, he knows APC is a total flop in Kaduna. Only a madman will vote APC. Really, you think so? Well, fanatical devil, that will be great. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. APC is gone from February 25th in Jesus' name. So shall it be. It can be, it can be forever because God Almighty doesn't even answer prayer of hypocrites. Where is his noise making son? I no longer hear from him. Anymore religion by gods, religious by gods. Erufa is one of the best governors, straightforward and frank. Mm -hmm. Really, where the day of reckoning is coming closer, closer, and closer. Day of reckoning, <laughs> the way Erufa has been talking, talking about Kabas, working against uh, Tinubu, mm -hmm. that should give you uh, should, should send a signal. <laughs> Some people are saying that he knows that he's not going to. Be able, we will not be able to deliver um Kaduna, you know, for APC or APC or 14 number. So that's why he's just trying to bring that a mechanism to see that some people are working against him. And also, he's of course, they are, you know, these people they all always know that the power they cannot even stay forever in a, that position, they know, and that's why they will prepare themselves. Whether they are going to spend four years or eight years, they would. Uh, eight years is a long time, almost a decade. Do you do you know what it means when somebody will be there? They must have prepared themselves. They know that they are going. And again, the new pharaoh might not know Joseph again, and they will walk their way out on how to fortify themselves, spare whether um physically, financially, and otherwise. And that's why he's saying that uh, if that happens, that if another party wins the part the, the state that is going to call them together so that there will be smooth transition your excellency sir this is politics without bitterness like seriously you believe him because they know that uh, the thi things things these things are falling apart and also hmm, it's not going to be business as usual so nobody should tell us uh, what is not statement statement ma karafi to call the shots by to the religious rods we fool we catch sinner. Hmm. A sound clap. Evil man. The coup has just begun. Hmm. The wise one we understand this simple body language. I used to wonder the kind of deadly game the mouse is playing with the dog or the cats. You and your APC should not intimidate other parties. Let's see if you can keep to your word. Because APC will be defeated in the, at the center and state, including your Cardona state. Those who understand him well knows it's just a political talk. So not to. No one will accuse him of anything contrary because he said some years that anything he says or is is political. Evil and devilish. Hmm. Erufai. Erufai. The mirrors are all over. Southern Kaduna with abandoned projects compared to Northern Kaduna, Mr. Interest of the state indeed. <laughs> Pre uh, premonition knocks at the door. Jackpot is the latest crazy in town. I think uh, this man said he really wants to go out of the country after he finishes his tenure. He wants to go and uh, do his uh, doctorate degree. He wants to go and get more education. 
And Buhari, a uh, Tinubu has been telling him, Oh, no, don't go, don't go, wait to. <laughs> well, I like him. He's a very pragmatic person. Well, if I is a pragmatic person, you believe that preparing for a well earned defeat, just allow the election to be free and fair. Let there be no manipulations at all. If you are sincere, it is a nice step. That is policies without bitterness. Wise man, I knew that APC is going nowhere. APC has choked Nigerians tomorrow. APC's Tinubu's defeat is already in the air. You won't even do anything. The reign of evil is over in Nigeria. You cannot even fight God. If your life remains in you, see, see then. Wow, Emilio PB PDP victory in Kaduna is sure by his grace. Nothing like holding power back or fighting once someone wins your state. Give it to them. APC has done nothing for eight years. The APC government has messed up everything. Just like a PDP have messed up in, uh, the country. Then so all of them are the same. Don't be surprised. This one can still go back to PDP tomorrow. Say whatever you want. The reality is no governor right from the first republic military or civilian performed as much as what he has done in Kaduna during his tenure. Sentiments can't even achieve anything. Gradually becoming sober. Hmm. They are gradually becoming sober. So guys, let's say your opinion and have your take on this.